Is your dad fancy? A little bit. <laughs> What's a little fancy about him? He has a lot of money. Red carpets, galas, bowls. Today we're talking to kids about how to become as fancy as humanly possible. Pinky's up, let's go. I am fancy enough. How are you fancy enough? I wear dresses like all the time and it's really, like, really fun. Who's fancier, you or me? Me. Should we have a fancy off? Yes. All right, fanciest pose, go. One, two, three. All right, comment below who won. Julia, who won? Definitely her. Okay, you won. <laughs> All right, bye. <laughs> and a lot of my friends are like cool and they they love slugs and bugs, but I don't like those and I just like I want to be a fancy girl. Are you a fancy girl? I dress up for a lot of things. Like I'm afraid I overdress for my sister's birthday. What I'm doing, it just feels right for me. All right, all right, pretty fancy. All right, pretty fancy, pretty fancy. What do you think of mine? Not very fancy, if I'm being honest. I think I kind of look like a, a geek today, or like a nerd, you know what I'm saying? Yes. Do you have a license? No. <laughs> <laughs> Terrifying. Are you fancy? Yeah, because I leave in myself, and every day is like I fancy in my own way. Each clothes I put on to express how I feel. Who's the fanciest person you know? Everyone, because everyone has a bright star inside their hearts. It grows every day. It doesn't matter what the outside looks, it matters what the inside. Yes. What are you eating? A Pasco. How is it? Good. Whoa! <laughs> you okay? What'd you say? I'm okay. Did you fall down? Yeah. Are you fancy? Mm-hmm. How are you fancy? Because I have this dress. I'm a princess. How long have you been a princess for? Since I was, since I was a baby. What would you do if you were a real life princess? I am a real life princess. You okay? Yep. Still fancy? Yep. You even more fancy than before? Mm-hmm. Do you think you can tell people who you are by how you dress? I know who I am. Just look, look at the sweet field in the grass. That's what my name means. It means sweetness, kindness, and the nice sun. Right now, just close your eyes. Please don't say nothing. Feel the wind. Feel how peaceful it is. It's so nice and peaceful. That's what my name means. The peace of quiet. Because I sweet, I kind. Sometimes I get a little rough. I want you right now just to put your hands on the ground and just close your eyes. It's like you connected to the earth. It's like you connected to Mother Nature. You have. Oh, sorry. How old are you? Six and a half. You know so much. <laughs> I know. Who's the fanciest person you know? Olivia Rodrigo is kind of fancy in a different way. How, what, what kind of way is she fancy? Nice and like pretty and all like, like being so cute. And then like, I don't like being fancy. I only like being fashionable. Am I dressed fashionable right now? No. <laughs> what do you want to say? about fancy people. Like, they think they're super awesome and like wearing all pink stuff and like blue or something like that. And like, they're usually really pretty. Like, they think they're all like princessy, like a princess. Do you think fancy people are better than you? No. Are they better than me? Maybe. So how was the ball for you last evening? Very cheap. Despicable the way these people treat us. No carriages anymore. Oh god, they make us walk and take Ubers. Be back to the 80s. Do you think things were fancier in the 80s? Very true, Monsieur. I propose that even though we could all do better, it is best to stay the way you are and not try to be perfect, because that's impossible. Well, good day, madam. Good day. It's okay to not be fancy all the time. Yes. Why? Because if you're fancy all the time, you'll just get obsessed with being fancy. And in order to be fancy, you need to be kind of rich and you'll just rob banks and stuff. You need to be fancy all the time, you'll probably end up robbing banks, right? Correct. Who mean everything to me? Who make my dreams come true? But it's not that blue. Whoa! 
Wow! What does fancy mean to you? Fancy means to me like you have fancy clothes, like you're cool and casual. Do you think everyone could be fancy? I don't know because then a lot of things would be sold out. How you can become fancy is you can go to Old Navy and get the clothes that you really like. That's what I do all the time. Not a sponsor, not a sponsor. Please Navy, please Old Navy, sponsor me please. Your body is a canvas where you express your emotions. You, sh you can pick any style you want. It's your choice. It's your body, even though your parents control you sometimes. What are some fashion don'ts? Um, I would never be caught wearing what my mom buys me sometimes because sometimes she gets like me old lady things. We don't like old lady clothes. I would describe my friends as just like preppy, tomboy. I don't know about weird core and kid core, but I still like them. If you want to be like really fancy, then you'll have to make a dance routine, like, you know. You have to what? You have to show off your skills, you know. You want a fancy dance? Yeah. All right, let's do it. This is my fancy dance. Which one of you is fancier? Me. Me. Well, each of us are the same, actually. I agree with him, cause we're like we look the same. We look the same because we're twins and we're identical, so we look the same. So if one of us were dressed up fancy and the other one, we would look the exact same fanciness. Either way, if we aren't fancy or fancy, we'll, we'll no so matter we're what, perfect. Look the same. We're, we're perfect. The same. What do you want to say to all the people out there who are like, how can I become more fancy? Be fancy no matter how you feel. Um, I'm going to say this once again, who people who didn't hear, you can pick anything you want. You can, you, can do, you can control your emotions. You can draw your art. You can, you can just express your emotion to your friends because they'll all care about you. Be anyone you want. You don't have to change it with makeup or anything. You're beautiful just the way you are. Well, thank you, my friend. This has been a beautiful interview. Thank you. Rock and roll. My name's Julian. What does that name mean to you? Julian is something like Junior. Oh, that's all you got? Your name is the trees and the sky. <laughs> My name is Junior? <laughs> yes.